Thanksgiving post feast workout. Got a lot to be thankful for. Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Today we're going to be hitting shoulders and arms and just get a little bit of a Thanksgiving pump in. So join me as I burn off all this uh, extra, you know, turkey, pie, uh, all the all the fixins, all the Thanksgiving fixins. Like I said, we're going to be doing, we're going to be doing shoulders and arms. Uh, yeah, so we're going to be doing shoulders and arms here in the garage. I would go to the gym, but, you know, it's a little rainy out. So I'm just going to work out here, here at the home gym. Uh, and there's nothing wrong with that. I love getting a pump here at the home gym. Everything tends to go pretty smooth here. I don't have to wait for anybody. So let's go ahead and hop right in. adding five pounds all right five pounds on each side we're adding it if you are wondering warm up with skip today okay look if you're wondering yes warm up was skipped today ah. Yeah, five pounds, five pounds on, the, on each side. Five pounds on each side definitely makes a difference. I've never maxed out on OHP, at least standing OHP. So I don't know what I can do, but uh, you know, maybe, maybe I'll start upping the ante a little bit. I'm trying to go, go a little heavier on standing overhead press. On to the next workout on this wonderful, faithful Thanksgiving day. Doing side raises right now. This will be the last set right here. Shoulders feel good. I'm probably going to end up supersetting uh, rear delts with triceps and biceps. Although, uh, you know, I did some back yesterday and got an indirect rear delt workout that way. But I'll probably do some lighter, higher volume uh, rear delt work. Uh, with my tricep pull downs once I get that set up. So this will be the last set on side raises. I'm gonna do the 60s. I'm gonna do the 60s this time. I don't care if it's sloppy. I don't care about form. 
I'm side racing the 60s, baby. If you can't side race the 60s after a Thanksgiving meal, I don't know what to tell you, but you're doing something wrong. All those calories combined with some coffee, or in my case, I had two rain energy drinks because I was feeling a little under the weather. So all those extra Thanksgiving calories combined with the two rain energy drinks, I'm feeling lively enough to side raise the 60s. Even if the form's not there, it's gonna happen, all right? So those 60s are gonna move. By the way, look, by the way, let me just show y'all. I was doing the 50s right now. It's on to the 60s right now. Read it and weep, lib turd. Yeah, lip turds, lip turds literally eating their words right now. I hope you're famished, lip turds. I hope you're hungry because you're going to be eating those words. All right. After watching this, all you lib turds out there, you're going to be nice and full. about this I've talked about this little pulley before right here and uh, definitely a home gym essential all right if I could recommend anything it would be a power rack and then this little pulley and one of my favorite reviews that I read on here or one of my favorite one of my favorite reviews that I read about this thing uh, someone was complaining because the weights feel heavier on the pulley than on a machine and uh, I just thought, you know, if it feels heavier, just lower the weight, you know what I mean? It's like, uh, that's a good thing. You want to train harder, all right? You want it to be harder. You want it to be heavier. So if it's making it harder for you and it's not necessarily destroying your joints, that's a good thing. Don't get me wrong. I love the ego lift, all right? But if, uh, if you're going to complain that the weights feel heavier, just lower the weight, you know? So, side raised the 60s earlier. I think now, now I'm gonna curl them. I got my 70s, I got, I got a pair of 70s here. Depending on how the 60s moves, maybe I'll, maybe I'll hop on the 70s. Too easy. Oh. Yeah, that moved easy. I think we'll uh I think we'll upgrade to the 70s now. Yeah, I think it's time to upgrade. 70s. Alright. Maybe I can get a rep PR. I, I I'm pretty sure I've done 70s at least once. I've curled the 70s before. Uh I know I've done it at least one time. So I forget if I've done it before. I've lived a lot of life since then, so right now I'm just going to say my PR for curling the 70s is one, one time, so I'm going to go ahead, and if I can do it more than once, that's a rep PR, and the name of this video will be uh, Curl PR, Thanksgiving Curl PR, or something, something along the lines of that, so we'll see, you know, maybe, maybe you guys will witness it right here. I might just run to the corner store after this and grab uh, another rain 
or a bang, uh, whichever. Probably a bang, honestly, the super creatine does wonders. All right, super creatine does wonders for me, uh, especially on Thanksgiving. You know, that combined with the, the chemicals in the turkey, you know, super creatine on Thanksgiving combined with all the chemicals in the turkey and the fluoride in the water, I think that'll do wonders for me. And that might bring me to a higher level, higher plane of existing, higher level of consciousness. And uh, I can move forward tonight. I probably won't sleep too well, but I have a four day weekend for that. So, uh, you know, I'll be able to stay up all night. I'll be up all night processing and getting used to uh, this new level of consciousness. The new lift order, all right? It all starts here and now, once I curl these 70s. 70. Let's go for three, come on. Ah. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Woo. All right, it's official. NLO initiated. Project NLO. All right, Project NLO initiated. Woo. Who cares if the form was there? Sure, I swung a little bit. That's okay though. Sometimes when your back's against the wall, you gotta swing. You gotta fight for it. And that's what I did, all right? So, as long as the weight moves in the garage, I'm happy. We do football reps here. I don't necessarily care too much about form. I don't care about any of that. This is my world, and I'm just documenting how I move about in it. But that's all about to change once I get this super creatine uh, here in about 10 minutes. I'm gonna cool off, you know, hop in the car, and head to the uh, the corner store and grab what I need to grab to get the night going. So anyways, thank you guys for watching this workout. Woo!